The Saucony Endorphin Speed 4 is the training companion of the Endorphin Pro 4 and it's designed for fast paced training runs. I'm Brandon with Running Shoes Guru. I've run over 80 Ks in the Endorphin Speed 4 and this is my full review. The Endorphin Speed Series is one of the most popular in the Saucony lineup. It's lightweight, it's comfortable, it's highly cushioned, and it looks like its more expensive racing counterpart, the Endorphin Pro. This is the Endorphin Speed 3, the predecessor. And to me, it felt more like an everyday trainer than a dedicated speed or race shoe. And this is because of how flexible it was. It didn't feel as fast as other training companions from other brands. This year's Endorphin Speed 4 feels faster than the Speed 3. And Saucony have achieved this by making two major changes. The first is that they've firmed up the midsole, and the second is that they've made the forefoot rocker feel more aggressive. So these two things make transitions faster and it makes it easier for you to increase your pace. I used this shoe for mainly speed workouts and I enjoy this version much more than the predecessor for up-tempo paces. And I feel like it has more punch. It still has a power run PB midsole and in my opinion, it doesn't feel as good as other midsole foams. It doesn't feel as engaging or energetic. So the ride of the Speed 4 feels a bit flat. Just like the Pro 4, the Speed 4's outsole has also been improved. The pattern on the forefoot rubber has been raised, so it grips the ground more effectively and traction is better. The upper of version 4 is better than version 3 because it's thinner and lighter. And my favorite feature are these holes on the top of the toe box for ventilation. The gusset's tongue is now wider and longer, so it doesn't slide around like in the previous version. And the fit is true to size. It also comes in a wide version if you need extra width. The Endorphin Speed 4 feels faster than the Speed 3, but it still doesn't feel as fast as other training companions due to its flexible plate. And the flexible plate also makes it feel completely different to the Pro 4. I would pick version 4 over version 3 because it feels faster and now it feels like a proper speed shoe. However, I think the majority of runners will still pick version 3 over 4 because it has a softer, more cushioned ride. If you're excited about the changes they've made to the Speed 4, let us know down in the comment section below. Thanks for watching and please remember to like the video and subscribe to Running Shoes Guru.